Is it over? Oh, thank God for that. It's finally January 1st. Hey guys, what's going on? And welcome back to What Shall We Do Next? I'm Mike, your host, and I hope you guys are having the best day ever. And this is an exceptional day because it is January 1st, 2021. You know what that means. 2020 has gone. I don't want to be the one to rain on anyone's parade here, but honestly, do I think 2021 is going to be better than 2020? Mm -mm. Nope, honestly, I don't. I think it's going to be exactly the same. Just because the calendar changed to a different number doesn't mean that anything's going to be different. Um, sorry to make you all depressed and stuff, but that's just my opinion. Hey, it might be the best year of our lives. Who knows? However, I am going to talk to you guys about my New Year's resolution, and I want you guys to let me know about your New Year's resolutions in the comments section down below. <laughs> But before we get into that, I do want to wish you guys a very happy new year, and let's just really hope for the best that it's going to be an actual improvement from last year. Uh, not to say that 2020 was bad or anything, like, I had a great year. <laughs> like, I don't know what everyone's freaking out about, I had a good year, but besides that, I, uh, I think it's been a pretty bad year for the majority of the world. Um, just with, you know, all kinds of problems and lock down this and suck my ass that, and like, it's just been hell, hasn't it, guys? <laughs> But I really am surprised at myself because for the most part, I really did enjoy this year and I didn't, or 2020, and I didn't let it get me down so much. I know I had a couple of mental breakdowns on YouTube this year, but that wasn't because of anything in particular except for just people talking about the fucking coronavirus and I just couldn't stand being around people anymore. And that was actually a real thing. Like I was actually like... You know, people who I once considered friends or like people who like even my work friends and stuff like that, like I was finding myself just getting angry at them. Like I was becoming angry at people and like just feeling this like I, I don't want to be around them, that kind of feeling. And it was just like that with everybody, even people in my own family. Like I felt like I was looking at them through the, the eyes of the devil sort of thing. It was like crazy. I, I've never had so much hatred inside me before than I did this year especially the end of this year like it just got too much for me so i think we should like just shut the fuck up about the coronavirus <laughs> like everybody because it's just gonna bring everyone down like if everyone shuts up about it and goes back to being normal human beings and have normal conversations that don't just surround the virus then i think the world would be a lot happier i think everybody is fed up with it at this point but everybody still continues to talk about it i i don't get it i really don't understand it but hey before I pop off again I'm not gonna go down that road uh, this is a brand new start to a brand new year and I plan on making it a good one 2020 was good for me like I said and 2021 I want to be better now my new year's resolution as you guys know my new year's resolution in 2019 was to upload videos every single day throughout 2020 and I did that I actually stuck to my new year's resolution and I completed it I did 365 days actually a little more because I did start doing daily videos before the end of December last year so I did technically I, I went a little over my new year's resolution um but I think for this year something that's really been bothering me a little more is that I haven't been I've been kind of finding that I'm just not you know I don't think about YouTube until like an hour before it's time to film a video and then I'm panicking and then I'm stressing out what I really want to do and I feel like also I feel like I rush everything and that's a big problem for me what I really want to do, this is going to be my New Year's resolution. I'm going to set a schedule and I'm going to make it a little more earlier than I normally would. Um, and I'm going to put a lot more work into my videos. I feel like I need to put a little more effort into my actual, like the editing part of the, the video process. Uh, I feel like I just want to put a little more editing into it to make it overall more entertaining to watch. Um, instead of just cutting and cropping and like adding a background music to it, but like, I feel like it would be cool to just like, I don't know, just go a little more out there. You guys have probably noticed over the last couple of weeks, I have been like doing that, just throwing in little funny clips and stuff like that. So that's something that I think is my motivation, uh, my new year's resolution this year. And I've got the motivation for it. So I think I can do it. But I want to know in the comment section, what is your new year's resolution for this year? What do you want to do this year that you 
are like feeling the motivation for you're feeling like okay i've wanted to do this for so long now it's time i'm ready for it this time i think i can do it like you've got genuine belief in yourself that you could do something this year um and as i said in my other video i am going to stick to the daily videos as stressful as it is and annoying as it is and you know always having to fit my life around youtube like i have to cancel plans and stuff like that i don't care like i really don't care like youtube is my number one priority as of now in terms of like you know what i'm doing with my life so i would say youtube is my number one top priority and that's the one that i'm going to focus more on and i'm going to focus less on the things that are not that important the things that just typically stress me out and i sit there and i think why am i getting stressed out about this this is not like what i want to do anyway so i'm going to just focus more on my channel and improving my videos that is my new year's resolution let me know what yours is in the comments i hope that you guys can be like feel the same motivation that i have to be able to do it and go through with it like complete it and it's a real feeling of satisfaction when you get to the end of the year and you finally realize like whoa i actually did it like i did with my uploading every day i feel somewhat of like a rewarding feeling to actually go through with your new year's resolution instead of just giving up after a couple of weeks so whatever it is believe in yourself do what it is that you love to do make whatever you want in your life make it a reality uh like i said in my last year's video but i actually showed the clip in my previous video from last last night like i said if you want, if you want, if you have like a dream and you want to get to that dream, but you're sitting there and you're getting all depressed and thinking, I'll never amount to nothing. I'm never going to get there. You won't get there with that attitude. First of all, um, if you're just going to sit there and cry, nobody's going to come bringing your dream to you on the plate and just hand it to you. Nobody's going to come knocking on your door and give you your dream in their hands. Nobody is going to do that for you. The world does not give a shit about you guys. It doesn't. And I know that's the that's the cold hard truth. The world does not give a fuck about me. It doesn't give a fuck about you. It doesn't give a fuck about your dreams. It doesn't give a fuck about your happiness. It doesn't give a shit about you guys. Like for real. Whatever it is. Like being serious right now. Whatever it is you love to do. And you're depressed. Or you're not happy with what you're currently doing. Find a way to make your dream a reality. And like I said in that previous video, it might not happen in 2021, might not happen in 2025, but it might happen in 2030 if you start now. The important thing is taking the first step. If you don't take the first step, you're never gonna get there. The only way you're gonna get there is taking that first step. Is, is It's a start. It might be a long journey, but it's a start. You're one step closer to your dream than you were you know, yesterday when you, when you hadn't taken the step, think about it like that. If you just sit around waiting, it's never going to come for you. And this isn't just about being a YouTuber or anything. This is about anything you want to do in life. If you want to travel, but you find you don't have the money because you can't help, but spend it on like shoes or shirts or like candy or whatever. Um, and you have a problem with spending and you just, you just like, Oh, I don't have the money. I'll never have the money to save. I'm too impatient for that. So I'm just going to spend it on like these little comfort treats, but those comfort treats aren't going to fulfill that hole, that empty hole that you have in your heart or whatever it is like <laughs> whatever you got down there. I don't know about you guys, but I got a heart in here, <laughs> but, um, I feel like what you need to do is you need to just come up with like, like organize your life and organize, come up with like a schedule and a certain, like if it's saving money that you need to do, you have to make sacrifices. You might have to sacrifice your favorite candy on the weekend or whatever, but put that money aside. And I promise you in like 12 months, you're going to have a lot more money than you would have if you'd been spending it on, you know, crap. Um, and then before you know it, you can put that towards whatever you want it to do. Maybe it's traveling to Hawaii. Who knows? Who knows? Whatever it is you want to do, find a way to do it. Take that first step. And the first step is always the hardest. But as you get the ball rolling, it becomes easier and easier and easier. So I promise you that. But you got to start somewhere. If you don't, you're just going to be, you're going to look back this time next year and you're going to be in the exact same place that you were last year. And you're going to think to my, think to yourself, like, I just wasted a whole year. I didn't even do anything. And I get that feeling anyway. And I, I've done something. Like, I've been making videos every day. I stuck to my New Year's resolution. But I still get that feeling that I didn't do enough. So if you didn't do anything this year, that's going to linger over you the next year. And the following year after that. And before you know it, it's been 10 years. And you're still in the exact same place. Working the exact same job that you hate. Because you've never took that step. 
So I hope that motivates you guys and doesn't bring you down too much. Don't have a panic attack over that. But just think about what I said and start slow. Take that first step. And uh, I promise you'll see results. You will. It might not happen, like I said, it might not happen this year or next year, but it could happen in the next five years or even 10 years. So whatever it is you want to do, find a way to make it happen and do it. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I know it wasn't really much, but uh, I just wanted to jump on here and say Happy New Year's and give you a little motivation if you don't really have anything planned this year. But I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hit the like button on this video, and I will see you right back here tomorrow with another video. Peace out, guys, and chase your dreams. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys enjoy my videos and you would like to support me and my channel more and also be featured in my videos, go check out my Patreon. Link is in the description. I would really appreciate any help you guys have to offer. As you can see, we have different tiers, different rewards. So go over there, check it out. And uh, I would really appreciate that. Every little helps. Thank you so much. And also guys, don't forget to subscribe with the notification bell on and also follow me on all my social media. I have Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and even Snapchat. So go follow Follow me on all of those and remember the most important thing, I love you guys and chase your dreams.